Hey guys, Boss 25 here. Here I am with one more video of the Hermes. Fantina Kobe B once again. You can see, well, obviously nothing has really changed except we have less fuel. And that we're orbiting Duna. We're being, well, okay, first off, the orbital insertion burn and the cur well, the curb and departure burn was. It was like three or four burns. And then the actual. Well, that just got us out of Kirby's SOI. And then the burn to get us here. The burn to, that got us here was around 20 minutes. Okay, Val, you can turn your SES off. Well, you can see the centrifuge works. As well as just going to stay in there, enjoying the artificial gravity, and also tapping into the station, into the Hermes' life support as well. So you can see it's it, it's in an almost polar orbit. It's like a, I don't even know. And I was wondering if I just did that, would like Val just pop out? But I think it, I'm really hoping Val can just push herself out down, 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 down. down. Up, 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 forwards, 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 up, 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 back, 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 up, up, up. We did, you know, I didn't want to just go flying back. Okay, you can see that that does its job. I, st I cannot wait to read that book. Yeah. I know the Hermes in the book is different because, well, that's basically an inflatable habitat with, like, a pole and then, like, a, an, an ion engine cluster and some radiators. But, okay, I'm... Um, First off, that would look boring. It's very difficult, and it's very difficult to create inflatable habitats. Well, basically, because of those, we, and it just looks. It doesn't look as good as this, I mean, seriously. I should have seriously put a command seed here. So it already has, like, a slight kind of thing. Probably presuming because the gyroscope is. Pressing the button down. I mean, I'm pretty sure Val would just sit if the command, if I did if I had put a command, see, Val would just sit here and admire the view. I mean, that's okay. That's just this is just a pretty spaceship. I mean, hey, Val's doing spins. Of course, I think I think these fuel tanks are pretty much empty. Because you can see, don't have much fuel left in so these. Oh no, these are. But that's not so. I'm presuming that what? And the bad thing is, like, I would need to wait for like a really long time for, th for these things to train to be able to transfer them with like those big tanks. <laughs> I don't even know. Yeah, the engines and the radiators <laughs> did get quite a workout here. I mean, for like several, well, I'm presuming weeks those things were going. I mean, when we were after the Kerman pressure burn, when we were at the Duna, like, two of these structural fuselages were, they were glowing. Okay, Val is playing the role of Commander Lewis, I think that's what she's called. Oh, Val. Uh, Of course, my Kerbal didn't come along for the ride because he is busy at the... He's busy maintaining the station as he's... Oh, I think Jeb's playing the role of Scott Kelly and my Kerbal's playing the role of Mikhail <laughs> I, I, I overthink these things by default. And a bad thing is, I could not time accelerate. I'm only getting 15 FPS. Uh, well, that's a stupid thing to do. Get out of that. First person EV mod would have been good now. What's this? Thruster? Wait, basically, I can just do that. Wait, what? What's that? I'm confused now. Oh, maybe the thrusters do fire, but she is not actually. It's not doing. Like, that I'm presuming is like dork. 
but okay if I do that, she's not moving up. If I have thrusters that will five, she will move up, but I'm going to set it to one hundred because I don't want to destroy. He'll be retracted by a Kerbal on EVA. So we're just going to test the radiator systems. Yeah, we just have to conduct a routine check as this is only a minor's orbital missions. Well, first off, I don't have much details on the lander unit. Not to be confused with the Lambda. Also, these are the size of the normal thing as well. You can just back away because I know that thing is huge. That thing is huge. Just, okay. If I like retracts at the same speed as the normal size one, but it's it's a whole lot bigger. Assuming we can re extend a lot. Now back up. Just look at that. Those are, like these are bigger than the ISS. Oh. Okay, well I'll get back to the capsule. Oh, so the caps is like, like I don't remember the name. I remember it's like something caps like the beat I think the mod but like the mod might be like capsule on pressure. I don't know. Right, well we might be able to find that once we go inside. I'm still surprised that I actually had the ability to make this. I mean, I have trouble making decent launch vehicles in Valentina while you do this. If I could just decouple that and send it off to deep space, which actually might not be such a bad idea, actually, if I think about it now. But I'm actually, like, when we're going back to Kerbin, once we're back at Kerbin, we'll probably, like, jettison that, just so we could have, like, a Thing. Wait, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, no. Val does not want to get back in. I don't. Well, I understand why she wouldn't want to get back in, but yeah. Yeah, no. Okay, that constant whirring you know, sound made by the by the IR. Joints. Climb, 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 climb. No, you lied to me. I can climb down. Climb further up. Can go up slightly. Or was that? Goodness, so long actually wants to stay. Now let's see what is this part called. Um, it's so bad because most of the fuel is at the back and therefore most of the waste is at the back. Uh, like tar yeah, it's Taurus capsule or something, I don't know. What is it? Heavy crew vehicle. Or huge crew vehicle, yeah. So the good thing is we're in an orbit where we get constant sunshine, so that's a good thing. So yeah. Hermes is at Venus. I'm about to 25. Goodbye.